Hi everyone, it's Strap Legend here, and in this video I'll be getting my 200,000 reputation, and uh, yeah. So I have picked up my quest and boss as I'm gonna do for this, and uh, 200,000 reputation has been a long time coming. The, I guess the first goal here, I guess that guy can kill it and can go Ash Fang. The first goal was to get the 100,000 reputation, but I've been still kind of grinding it because it's kind of fun. And I'm about to get 200,000 now, and like, I don't know what I'm gonna do after that, I'll be honest. I think 200,000 was the next big goal. I guess 250,000 is pretty cool, but I think after I get 200,000 reputation, I'm gonna chill a bit. Like, I've kind of just every day had, like, goals of two dailies, but I think I'm gonna throw that away now and just do dailies whenever I want to, because... No one's reaching me, I'm number one leaderboard by a long shot, and uh, there's no real point of going past 12,000 reputation boat factions. You know, I've been doing this just kind of because, oh, leaderboard position, fun, big number, fun. But I feel like after 200,000 it kind of loses its point, because if I don't get 500,000, which will take years, or a million, which will take like 10 years, no, I think it's like 5 years of everyday grinding, uh, it's just not gonna be worth it in my opinion. And they don't seem to be doing anything with reputation, even symbols, with, no, I mean emblems with the leveling update didn't have anything with reputation. Reputation still hasn't had some of its bugs fixed, it still sucks, it has no rewards, and uh, yeah. It is what it is, I guess, it's kind of like one of those forgotten uh, systems in the game, similar to uh, item durability, you know when some dungeon items have durability, so you need to pay like 10 coins to fix them every now and then, that's basically reputation. It's <laughs> well, not basically reputation, I think reputation is slightly more useful, because it doesn't lock your kudra, I guess. But I guess that's just locking kudra be behind some content that isn't really content. I feel like the quest should give you more rewards for sure. Like right now you just kinda like, for example I do the rescue mission I get two leather cloth. Why wouldn't I just kill two barbarian dukes? The combat XP is bad. Like why would I do that? It's just not good. Like the only thing where a daily has actually good rewards is when it has Lumino Fiber. Because that's like, well I'm doing Ashfang like right now. And usually daily quests are faster than doing like two ash fangs, so you can get some like a couple of million from that, but not much to be fair. So yeah, daily's just gonna suck. Reputation sucks. The system sucks. You get minions, you get Kudra, but the minions are just upgrades. A single minion. Like, what if you don't wanna use that minion? Then it's useless. Anyway, 300, which I have picked out the quests there. That should give me that spectre dust 40. Do I have that here? I do have that here. So let's get this, comeback to use, like that's worth it, like Spectre just for a comeback to use if I ever craft that because this can be used for a of money, not much though. Yeah, I'm getting leather cloth from this, which like, again, rescue mission is pretty easy once you get used to it, so it's not that bad, but I still feel like it's just not worth it, like I could have killed two barbarian dukes and swapped lobbies in this time for sure. But it is what it is. I do hope they do something with reputation because like right now it's one phone number at 12,000 mage reputation which is like fine I guess. Then there's the minions but I feel like just having two minions for it is uh, not super uh, good. And then you get obviously the Kudra unlocks, which is like, okay, that's like locking stuff behind something for no reason. Except, oh, time get it. But I will say, um, they're somewhat fun, fun to do. I think a lot of people hate dailies, but I'm obviously not a hater of dailies because I do them every day. And uh, I still hope that they someday bring rewards, maybe cosmetic rewards to high reputations and like stuff to buy from the emissaries because the stuff you can buy at the emissaries is not basically nothing, like it's so low. There's like one necklace at Mage Faction and you unlock it pretty fast, it's a painful grind, grind and the necklace is worse than the Rift necklace by a long shot, that's easier and more fun to get and faster to get. 
So it is what it is, I guess. But I will say that I do have some ideas for what could be added. I've made an, a forum post about it too. I'll leave that in the description if you're interested in uh, checking that out. And, wow, that's a... <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna finish dailies by doing swiftness rank C. I guess not the most uh, most fun stuff to end it on, but it is what it is. So, let's uh, get this swiftness rank C. It'll be super hard, probably. I mean, with this lag, to be fair, if I fail it the first time, it would be pretty funny. Swiftness is here. Okay. So 200,000 reputation comes once I do this and take my armor off. So reputation... I've been grinding reputation for a long time. I think I've explained this before, but basically, yeah, in my level 320 video, I think. I started just doing dailies to get 12,000 reputation in preparation for updates. I didn't even do every daily, but then I just noticed somehow I was number one on the leaderboards, so no one else was grinding, I guess, every daily. Not I didn't even grind every daily, I grinded like three daily quests. But no one else was actually like getting reputation in preparation for updates, so I was number one. So I was like, okay, well I guess I'll just keep grinding, and I've been number one ever since. I think once I got a hundred thousand reputation and I went to like a hundred and thirty thousand or whatever, does that make sense? No, that doesn't make sense. 170,000, 50,000, whatever, to get the mage maxed, switch back, and got back to 100,000 reputation. Well, I mean, I had that. Wait, how did it work? I don't remember. Anyway, I got 100,000 reputation when I returned, after I spent like a month, a bit less than a month on mage faction stuff, and I was still number one by like a long shot, so I was like, Okay, yeah, I guess I'll do this, and uh haven't looked back ever since about get to get 200,000. I think number two has like 70k, so I'm like almost triple that. I actually haven't checked in a while, so they could have like 100,000, but it doesn't matter. They cannot reach up to me. Anyway, let's claim my two Bezos here, and uh yeah, there it is. 200,000 reputation. Jesus. So yeah, I I probably will be slowing down now. There's no real point in grinding reputation. But that is that is a great looking number, I will say. I will say 250,000 might be even cooler. 300,000, well, I don't know. I think 300,000 will look worse than 250k. <laughs> but I'm not sure. Yeah, I guess that's really what I did. I didn't have much else to record here, and uh, yeah. Thanks for watching and uh, try to take my spot. <laughs> See ya.